Hi pet lovers, thank you for joining Gina's Grooming Channel. Today we're going to be talking about pre-clipping, a why and when to do it with Louie, a white standard poodle. So let's go ahead and define pre-clipping. As uh, the name suggests, this is us going ahead and removing coat before the bath. Most professional grooming and haircuts are done after the bath, but there are some very critical reasons why a groomer may choose to pre-clip before putting a dog in the bath, which is what I'm choosing to do with Louis today. So um, the reason why we avoid doing it is because we are putting clippers on dirty, oily hair. Um, but again, sometimes we can't help it. We have to do it for good reasons. So let's talk about those reasons. The first and most important one is if a dog is matted, you have to pre-clip. We can't put a matted dog into the bath and get them wet. Uh, the second reason, which is Louis, uh, which he has a thick coat. So it takes a long time to dry a thick coat. So I want to go ahead, and he usually gets a short haircut anyway, um, and we'll talk about the blade that I'm using. Um, but he's got a thick coat, so it helps me in time to go ahead and take this coat down. You also have medical issues, which Louis also has bad legs. So we want to make sure to cut down that drying process as much as we can. Um, and that's why I'm going to go ahead and pre-clip him. And also some dogs are just afraid of the dryer. So we want to go ahead and minimize their time. Now for dogs that you're going to be leaving with uh, either a top knot or a puffy tail, you want to make sure to pre-brush uh, before you put in the bath. So we're going to go ahead and get him nice and clean. And because we pre-brush his head and tail, we're able to go ahead and get that shampoo and water all the way down to the skin. Of course, blow dry. And now I'm going to go ahead and do the haircut. I'm finishing him with a number four. Um, that is a guide comb uh, on my clipper. I'll give him a little more of a velvet look, even though I did my pre-clip with a five. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do all of the tasks in detail. This is now my detail work while the pre-clipping was really kind of a dirty, fast, get that hair off, get him in the bath, and make sure that we avoid having him drying for a long time. All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead, speed up the process, turn on some music for you, and I'll meet you back here when he is all done. Well, all right, he is looking beautiful, sleek, putting a bandana, finishing him up, all giving him some love. So there you have it. That is the final product for pre-clipping and then doing his haircut and finalizing it after we went ahead and washed him and fluffed him out. But we did not have to keep him on the table for very long for the drying, so saved a lot of time and saved Louie from having to stand up very much. Thanks for watching. Thanks for joining. Appreciate your time.